Hi, my name is Lily with Flame Off Coatings, and today's video is all about the resources we have available to you to help you with the application process of an intumescent coating. Even if you're not sure yet about using an intumescent coating on your project, I would say it's still worthwhile checking out these resources. First, I would like to provide a quick disclaimer about the use of intumescent coatings. So me personally, when I buy a product, I don't want to read the paper instructions. So if I get a new piece of furniture and it comes in, I'm going to try to put that thing together before touching paper instructions. But the thing is, when it comes to fire rating something, it's a little bit more serious than that. When applying an intumescent coating, it is vital that you follow instructions because if you don't, you're not going to get the fire rating you're looking for. Before applying an intumescent coating, you have to think of the various factors that could affect your application process. Those things would include, what's the fire rating I'm looking to get? Is this an old building? Is this a new building? Do I need a primer? What surface am I applying on? There are so many things that can affect your application. The reality is with something as serious as fire safety, you have to be mindful of those instructions because if not, you could have some costly consequences. Now I'm going to show you where to go on the website to find those helpful resources. Let's go. In order to find our intumescent coating resources, you need to go to our products tab on the website and click on our fire barrier paint. This is the intumescent coating we sell. Then scroll down and click the technical data tab. Here are all of the wonderful resources that you can use for free. After that, you will see our application guide. Go ahead and click that PDF file. This should be able to answer all of your general questions about applying an intumescent coating, such as ours. If you're interested in learning more about our product, the Fire Barrier Paint, go check out our submittal spec sheets. They'll cover the nitty gritty of everything you need to know about our product. It contains the required DFT and how many mils you need per coat, it has details on our testing and maintenance, cleanup, all that sort of stuff. But yeah, please go check out this technical data. It's a free resource for you to use and it's super helpful. Now that you know where everything is, I'll leave you with one last bit of advice. Always remember that what is on paper is standard and you never want to go just based off of word of mouth or speculation. Trust me, you can thank me later when this saves you while you're looking for the right product. Also, always remember when you're looking for a product, product marketing can sometimes be misleading. So make sure that whatever's said in a video can be backed up by proper documentation. Thanks for watching. And as always, we are happy to be your trusted partner in fire safety. If you have any questions, feel free to comment them down below.